Hey everyone, this is Man in the Black Hat. And Game Collector. And we're back for more Mass Effect on Gamers Embassy and YouTube. Yep, we're back in Enormity, just kind of standing, staring at the bat, doing nothing. Oh, wait, Message never mind. Patch it through. Commander, Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. You don't come off very well. She talked rings around you. With all due respect, Admiral, I'm a soldier, not a public speaker. She shouldn't have ambushed you. We have a press corps for a reason. Nobody's blaming you. Just wanted to let you know what the response was back home. I won't keep you any longer. <coughs> <coughs> Admiral Badass is basically our biggest supporter of site for Anderson. Yeah. Okay, but, I think it's time a... to go to Novaria. But yeah, there's a reason why I generally, I generally tell her jack shit and give gender neutral, and just give completely neutral answers. I don't know why I almost said gender neutral answers. <laughs> that wouldn't make sense in context. Commander Shepard, what gender are you? Um. Yes. <laughs> Tell my wife I said hello. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have this cough forever. Yay, you're going to the snow planet. Yes, I am. Novaria, the planet where corporations can go to conduct illegal research into interdimensional teleportation. Seriously? That's what they're researching? No, but, uh... Approach control. Yeah, the this line from SSB Doom North. does kind of fit. Vector and <clears throat> Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a Council Spectre aboard. Commanding access granted. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. <laughs> I love his snarkiness. Yeah. Kind of hard not to. Really hard not to. Oh, by the way, at this point in time, I have just finished um, filming a section of Mass Effect 2 where we find out the fate of Navigator Presley. So, uh, all the sad. Yeah. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Log, the commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. I will admit that Miranda Lawson makes a better XO than Presley did, simply because she spent her time in the XO's office doing XO stuff. Yup. That's far sort enough. Sort of, I guess. Something wrong, officer? You better hope there isn't. Oh, this I'm is going to look forward to killing you. Your credentials. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. We will need to confirm that. Both of them? Also, I must no, advise you that firearms are not coming oh, yeah. out of the area. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. No. It would not be wise to search for the Geth unarmed. Says the lady who's currently glowing. Stand down. Their house, their rules. I'll be behind you. That armor's in good condition. Captain Matsuo, stand down. We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini-san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. Eat me. Uh, Get out. Well, she's going to be eating something later, and it won't be you, but it will be made of metal. <laughs> Tungsten. <laughs> and a lot of it! Oh yeah, right to the face. Be force-feeding her tungsten. Well, you know, 
Isn't one of the required elements that you need to have in your body made of tungsten? I, am Gianna I don't think so. Assistant well, she's getting an ex... We it looks like her doctor is going to prescribe her an extra large dosage. I appreciate <laughs> oh, yeah. your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. Your security chief is awesome. Orientation of new her help sucks. Do you have any questions? Yeah. You're going to change that very shortly. Oh, yeah. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? <gasps> Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Benezia? She is here? Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? <laughs> His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I can't have my investigation hampered. Tread lightly. The board can bury you in litigation. You'd need an Asari lawyer to see the case through. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. No, I don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're part of my crew. At this point, Thank yeah, you, that's kind of valid. That means a great deal to me. Yep. She's actually earned trust on several missions. Several missions that only took a few Welcome seconds to each. The galaxy's most Even so, she performed for fairly well. Scientific research Except for the parts where she was shooting at walls. Can't to help the that. All the AI members. does that. Yeah. Any directions given by our security personnel. If you have the AI gets a lot concerns, better at that in second and third games. I you. wouldn't doubt it. <laughs> the managers warned us about you. <laughs> This one offers greetings. You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. Sure, whatever. This is a store, right? Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. Non human armors. Let's see what they got. Let's hope it's something good. And they only got one Quarian armor. Phoenix 5. Heh. <laughs> Is in except for tech biotic protection, it's worse in every single bit. This one, yeah, Phoenix armor is generally meant for biotics, yeah, and she medics. Travels fast here. And she is not a medic, indeed, esteemed specter. Your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. This one has a burden that you could ease if an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it. I really place. hope he doesn't want you, you to want carry to some crack to in your you. stomach. That <laughs> is not inaccurate. I won't carry anything if I don't know what it is. This one must be discreet. Rest assured. The contents pose no threat to anyone within this port. I want to know where this package is going. This one's customer prefers to remain anonymous. I'd be stupid to do this without knowing I'm not equipping my own enemies. Your words are not unreasonable. The customer is the Krogan called Inamorda. That one is a bounty hunter of some repute, and quick to anger. You understand this one's urgency. That other grows restless from the delay. Dude, just sell the Samus Aran no instead. This one humbly thanks the Spectre. The package will be delivered to your Apparently vessel. you're taking this All you quest do for is bring some it reason. This one. Yeah, I'm taking Please the quest. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy... fees. 
Is there anything else this one might help you with? I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits your return. Doop 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 doop. And going back out to get the thing. Yep. Because we can, because we're Spectre. Also, booty booty. Booty! I am in no way objectifying these two fine women. I am simply staring at their butts. Objectifying them would require a lot more effort. Yep. And really, really, really bad writing. Well, that and having no, absolutely no respect for them, and like I said, they are fine women. And I don't mean that as in beautiful fine, oh. I, I mean in that as in sense. they're very good people. Yes. Even if they are fictional characters. Yes. Hey, Guybrush Streepwood, Guybrush Streepwood was a fictional character, and he was a good guy, mostly. Yeah. <laughs> he couldn't help it that he was dumb. Nope. Doop 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 doo. Nothing to see here. Good day, Commander. I trust you are behaving yourself, not mixing yourself up in any questionable activities. I don't generally get involved in that sort of thing. No, of course. I thought you'd be too intelligent for such a thing. If you were, I would have to recite some tedious speech, then ask you to leave. Just so we understand each other. Tell me about yourself. You first. I'm just a security guard. I heard that there were no human specters. How did you get that job? My crew and I were involved in Saren's raid on Eden Prime. You disabled the nuke. That makes sense. Special Tactics likes people who can think on their feet. I served in the Marines for a decade, mustered out and went private sector. I was under fire a few times, so I ended up leading this detail. Huh. That's kinda neat. There are guards everywhere. Are there that many problems here? I'm sure Parasini-san gave you the ultra-special blah-blah about business here. Everyone wants to be protected from everyone else, but everyone also thinks they have a special right to kick over everyone else. So you have to keep them from being <laughs> the leader. Most of my job is diplomacy. Two corps start yelling at each other, my people walk in, flash some ceramic, and they start talking <laughs> civilly. If there is anything this job has taught me, it's how to be impartial. I'll be moving on. Very good, Commander. Please stay out of trouble. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Yeah, keep your eye open. It'll be full of something soon. Keep your eye open. That way you'll see the attack coming. I love how Bioware subtly makes you dislike her. So subtle. Such wow. Oh yeah. So subtle that she's blatantly obviously a bad guy from the out go. Shepard got the thing. He got the thing good. Greetings, Spectre. <laughs> Have you brought the package? Here you are. The Spectre has done a great service for this one. From the deepness of light, it thanks you. This one promised compensation for services rendered. It humbly suggests that a sum of 250 credits would be most appropriate. Would you have had any chance of getting this past customs without me? You can be a bit more generous. The other's words possess the discomforting ring of truth. This one could raise the sum to 500 credits. That is half this one's profit taken by the other. It can offer no more. That's thoughtful of you. This one is glad to have come to an agreement. 
I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits you over time. Bye bye, jellyfish. I'm on duty, Spectre. I shouldn't be talking to you. Oop -de -doop -de -doo. Nothing to see here. I'm just going in and talk to this lady, not doing nothing not doing nothing secret spectry stuff. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> How can I help you? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas. Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine, come in. God, this asshole. He talks like he's on, like, eight cups of espresso. Well, he is well, a Solarian. Excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain space-born vagabonds. I see you looked up my service record. Only a fool enters negotiation without knowledge of the other party's tendencies. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. I'm not here to investigate your tenants. Nevertheless, I have a responsibility to keep you away from them. Spectres are not encumbered by a need for due process. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Benezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. I'd like to see her, immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the I area. just noticed Shuttles the shadows to his side are... It's weird. Back to my other questions. Every minute of my time you waste costs the company 12 credits. I will keep a running tally. Do you do business with Saren? Agent Saren? One of your Spectre compatriots? He is a major investor in Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. I have no more questions at this time. Well, that explains all the binary helix missions in one go. Mm-hmm. And why they're always involved with zombies. Mr. Analeas isn't the only one with a past to leave Hanchan. No, it's the, uh, Exo Jenny ones that involve the zombies. Oh, oh, right, 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 right. Never so mind. Would see. Binary helix usually involves mercs. Talk yeah. to Ulrich Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not with an earshot of Mr. Analeas. Talk to you later. Very well. Nope, not doing any sort of spectry stuff with her. Nope, 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 nope. Were those workout bikes? No, those are uh, individual extranet terminals. Oh, they look like workout bikes. They're the same extranet terminals as the one on the Citadel. Except... On the Citadel. Huh. Even if I can't talk sometimes. Yeah, that happens. Mm-hmm. Okay. And another elevator. Where the booty shot? Yup. Booty booty. Exo Gen <laughs> Novaria is very generous with the booty shots. Yep. All the elevators do that. And up we go. Ding. Menswear. Excuse me. Hi there. I need a moment of your time. The male human at the hotel bar. He's a sales rep for the <coughs> Felix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are, Dullstone. That makes you ideal for my job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your... my... real intentions. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in Binary Helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. 
Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here is the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off-topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'll go see him now. I hope to hear from you soon. This doesn't seem like a Paragon mission, but then again, we're on a planet run entirely by corporate people. Can I help yeah, you? it's a renegade mission, but is, Mr. Vargas, it does have a Sheriff, Paragon Systems outcome. Alliance military. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Rafael Vargas, sales. Were you interested in our services? It's customary to perform minor genetic upgrades upon enlistment. I've been assigned to see what BH has to offer. It was my understanding that the Alliance contracted to Mars Gene for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. We can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide an 8% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in ZG muscle degeneracy. I've never heard of a technique that improves zero-gravity endurance. It's a first for the industry. The advent of Element Zero-based artificial gravity made it a less pressing concern. We're still waiting for tests to give us an average improvement. We estimate a 7 to 11 percent decrease in muscle loss rates. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. For a bulk order, I can work in a sensory enhancement package, guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. How would you distribute the upgrades? Retroviral injections would take some time. Well, it does take time to upgrade a body with adjusted DNA. Skin cells could be replaced in two weeks, but the liver takes over a year and the skeleton a decade. For frontline units, we can speed the process with full system transfusions and injections to stimulate regrowth. It would still take six months to see results. I have to admit, it surprised me that you were here for business. There are many development projects on Avaria, some not entirely legal. If I had a higher paragon, does Binary if Helix only. have any less than above board projects? I'll keep my source confidential. Certainly not. Our corporate reputation is sterling. I can assure you all of Binary Helix's operations on Novaria are strictly alive. Right. I'm sorry, Mr. Vargas. That's a call I have to take. Thank you for your time. Of course, Commander Shepard. We look forward to hearing from you. You know, honestly, if I was Commander Shepard, I would have submitted a report to the Alliance anyways that Binary Helix might have something Excellent. better to offer. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. Only 500? All right. I thought you might have wanted to provide more. Since you couldn't do it yourself, I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. That's better. Good day, Spectre. Did you say 750? You meant your entire paycheck. Come on, cop it up, lady. Sit down. And you got plus two renegade. Yeah. Are you Lorik Keen? I've heard you might be able like to I help. Like I said, it has a you renegade a mission, but arrived, a are you not? beneficial outcome. What can old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office. For the moment, at least. 
Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's his one left, his one eye is really progress. screwed up. I know. There. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons It's like the eyelid is clipping <laughs> over the eye when it shouldn't be. Yeah, that's just a glitch. Lies outside this port. It's funny, though. His impersonality. Let you yeah. Like, he has muscle spasms or something. The He's having an eye twitch. I will give you my garage pass, as well as a this is really pass. stressing me out. Can you take care of this for me? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. I'll focus on trying to get your evidence. If I'm lucky, I won't have to fight anyone. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep bloodstains off the <laughs> computer, don't you? <laughs> And here comes another booty shot. Mm-hmm. Brought to you by Novaria's Elevators. Oh, wait. No, never mind. This is uh, just over the shoulder. Yeah. Oh, well. So much for that. Sorry. False alarm. It will. I guess you're going to be handling most of those subquest missions when you get back. Um, subquest missions. The one about the key. Because you're going into the garage. Oh, no, no, no. I can't even leave this area until these subquests are done. Oh. I'm going up to his office. Oh, so you are. Hi there, assholes. Freeze! Hanshan Security. This office is sealed. Laura Keen gave me a pass in. Keen? Are you working for him? He's under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keen. Analeas has a Varen up his ass about this guy. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. And thus two out of the rest of them survive. Two smart ones. The rest are going to die. Horribly. I actually managed to do this one with some level of stealth. Huh. Can't see how, considering it opens with a firefight up just about every time. Well, and when I say stealth, I mean I I was actually able to take most of these people out with a sniper rifle. Ah. That I makes see more the, sense. I see them, but they don't see me, and you then do. they die. A lot. Yeah. Now, because I was was playing as I think the operator it's called. Because my only specialties are the pistol and the sniper rifle. Mm. That's why I was able to snipe so good. Later on, once I got a super-powered uh, shotgun, that more or less became a secondary weapon for killing things that I want dead now. Killing things up close. Yeah, when you want them dead and dead now. Really? She couldn't hit him at point blank range. Was she using the assault rifle? Probably. It might explain it. Do 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 do. Banana night. Do 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 do. Banana night. Do 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 do. Yeah, you found evidence. Yep. 
And also, he has like a Zen water fountain. Indeed. Hi. Oh, hi, dead people. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. No, I'm not. Are you? I'm Sergeant Kyra Stern. Yeah, we don't care. Services. So that's what you want on your tombstone, you right, lady? For what you did. <laughs> I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? You are here off duty breaking the law for bribe money. You expect us to feel bad for Ooh. stopping you? I didn't want to fight them. They fired first. Well, I don't need a gun. Yeah, you're fighting Commander Shepard. You're gonna need a lot more than a gun to tear him to pieces. And she's dead. And Yay. Garth's dead. Yeah, she's dead. And nobody gives a shit. Oh, oh hi. hi. I'm gonna shoot you in the hip a lot. Oh, never mind. I'll shoot you in the nuts. Is it? What, what's that blue glowing disc right there? That's Is a grenade. Yeah, you should probably be a little bit concerned about that. I should, but for some reason it's not going off. Huh. Oh, it's one of mine. Oh! It's a glitch nade. And you're booping the boops. Mm-hmm. And now you can get into that app. <coughs> Medical <laughs> kit. And a wall safe. With... Shredder rounds. Tonight I'll dine on turtle soup. Sadly, Uncle Phil, the voice actor of the Shredder, passed away last year, or earlier this year. Uncle Shredder, no! Yeah, that's sad. I know. He led a good life and had a good career. And was made into a great meme. Indeed. Booty shot! Yay. Booty shot over. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? Noise? What noise? is thugs ripping the place apart. Smart ass, huh? That's fine. I can work with that. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Noise? What noise? I didn't kill anybody. There aren't any bodies up there. Anymore. Hmm. I gotta say, I love the Zen fountains here. Oh, yeah. This corporation really knows how to make the dull gray walls of the facility look somewhat less dull and gray. Zen garden look. They I mean, couldn't the giant... slap some paint on some of these walls? I mean, yeah. seriously. Of course that would help, but still, the giant rocks kind of give it an interesting tone. You know, I've seen better interior decoration from an Omni Consumer Corporation. Ah! <laughs> Wait, the one from the 80s or the modern one? Allow yes. me to reintroduce myself. Okay! Arasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Why is an internal affairs agent here? The executive board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. I need Keen's garage pass to complete my mission. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. In the long run, it is better to remove the source of the problem. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. All right, I'll talk to Keen and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. 
I have no interest in a public spectacle. And his eyes twitching again. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas' extortion. You might end up a hero. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. The board was already investigating Analeas. They're concerned about the worm and their own fruit. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. Okay. And now we go back downstairs. With That's a nut. So many glo... Glo... I can't talk either. Gratuitous? Yes. Gratuitous booty shots. My not ability to talk is spreading. Soon it will take over the world! Are you going to add in the ma maniacal laughter or not? No, the maniacal laughter is implied. Ah. Someone murdered our people in the Synthetic Insights office. Nope, not us. We weren't anywhere near that when that happened. <laughs> oh, there's that maniacal laughter. Yeah, it just got misplaced. No, I was just waiting for the right cue. Seriously, slap some paint on these walls. I don't care what color. Just as long as it's not gray or white. Or brown. Something colorful. Something that won't make it like a Spectre, hallway out of have Gears you given of War. Any more consideration yeah. to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. I didn't think you'd help me, being a specter and all. I guess some of you can be all right. Doesn't this help you? You don't seem particularly happy. I'm ecstatic, but right now, I just feel like a long day of work is ending. While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Yeah. Be careful up there. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate <laughs> skirts. This is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. <laughs> you, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. See you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. Yes, she does. Well, you got eight Paragon for that. Makes up for the two Renegade you got earlier. Yes, it does. Yeah, those things right there, they look like... Oh, yeah, they are terminals. I told you. They're differently shaped from the ones on the Citadel, though, which is why I thought they were exercise bikes. Ah. Uh, why would there be exercise bikes in a corporate office? The hell do I know? They're corporate executives. I don't know how they think, aside from stupid. <laughs> I don't know how to think stupid without faking it. Well, that's true. You haven't spent enough time in Texas. I heard the administrator. Purple and arrested. orange. Interesting color combination, Any you dude. Had something to do with that? He was corrupt. <laughs> Most people here are. I wish you could take them all down. Wow. What can I do for you today? He's from Jersey. Jersey like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening? On. Here? There's a problem on Peak 15. Or whatever the Turian homeworld is. Shut down by Analeas. Turian Jersey. Yeah. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. Huh. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Makes me think of Ben Grimm. Never cut the satellite up a little bit, yeah. Before. Yeah. Anyways, this is Man in the Black Hat. And Game Collector. We'll see you next time for more Let's Play and Mass Effect on Gamers Embassy and YouTube. Back a little Later. What do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshan. Just call me Lee. Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got a team of 12 under me, 
keeping the shuttles coming and going. What was that about synthetic insights? Analeas had shut down SI. Looks like he was trying to blackmail him. It happens often enough. He got caught this time, though. Looks like the executive board is going to feed him to the Nathak. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here.